Hey everybody, welcome to the newest episode of BlizzPlanet.com's Week of Warcraft. Now as always, I'm your host, the bearded gamer, Chris Arnone. All right, so first off, we're gonna start off with last week's question and highlight some great answers to that one. So last week we asked, with pet battles now in the Mist of Pandaria beta, how do you feel about them? Let's see those highlights. Great responses. Now let's get into that weekly news roundup. Here's the beef. So big news this week, Michelle Morrow is getting an NPC with bonuses. Now she's an actress who kind of made her name as a sort of a B horror movie actress in things like Basement Jack. Well she started to get known around the World of Warcraft sort of circles uh, because she was campaigning to try and be selected as the voice of uh, or as Lady Sylvanas in the maybe possibly upcoming World of Warcraft movie. Well, it ends up she's made some friends over at Blizzard, and so now they are installing some new NPCs. So you can find her as uh, May Shell, ha ha ha, uh, and her cats Azrael and Samus, and her boyfriend Lamplighter Moo are going to be in the starting areas for Pandaria, so that's that's pretty awesome. And uh, we are at blizzplanet.com, we're great friends with Michelle, and we're planning to do a little uh, live stream Mist of Pandaria beta in the near future with her, so stay tuned for that one, it's gonna be a lot of fun. Uh, Deluxe Edition, let's talk about Collector's Editions. Now, there's been no official word from Blizzard on a Collector's Edition, but over in the Public Test Realms page, we're seeing some box art pop up, and there's a lot of speculation running around. One of these things is, what if there is, in addition to like the physical standard Collector's Edition you're used to, what if there's a digital only? None of physical goods, lots of digital goods. Maybe that's what's coming down the pipe. We'll have to wait and see. Now, there's also an update coming down for Pet Battles. Okay, so... Beard Game Rats is you! Really? I want to be the very best! Really? What did I tell you about last time you got on my set? Not to dance. You just danced. Go! He is just so excited for those pet battles. It's... Oh, you... Really... Uh. Anyway, they're updating those godforsaken things that Eldorian loves so much. Uh, in the next beta patch, uh, you're going to get some unique tamer pets. Uh, there's going to be a Grandmaster Tamer, one on each continent. And if you beat it, you unlock all the daily quests for that continent. Uh, there's going to be 40 new tamer fights, and all the quests are going to be uh, to fight tamers will be account wide. So if you do them once, you open it up to all of your different tunes, which is pretty cool. So we'll end as we often do with a question and no dancing. Just a question, okay? What digital content? Would it take for you to choose an all digital collector's edition over your standard physical slash digital collector's edition you're used to buy? We want to know what kind of cool items would Blizzard have to throw at you to entice you to go pure digital with your collector's edition instead of getting something to take up room on your shelf. Let us know in the comments, throw it down, and of course we'll highlight the best ones next week. And while you're on YouTube, YouTube, check out the Bearded Gamer Show. It's awesome. I know I just mispronounced YouTube. It was kind of strange. Anyway, and then check it. Check out blizzplanet.com. All the news, reviews, fantastic community, everything you need to know about Blizzard Entertainment Games. See you guys next time. Now, we just showed an episode. We were talking about the possibilities of the Mist of Pandaria Collector's Edition. Well, guess what? Right the day after we filmed it, big announcement, okay. Mist of Pandaria, the next World of Warcraft expansion, is launching September 25th. Now you can buy just you know the standard physical package or the digital version for $39.99. But wait, 
we got a little more. Okay, now there will be a digital only deluxe edition. Now what comes with this is a Kylan flying mount, a Kylan pet, some StarCraft II portraits, and a Diablo III sigil and accent. And that's gonna run you $59.99. Okay, but there's still gonna be a standard collector's edition that you're used to with a nice box and all the cool stuff. So it's gonna have everything that's in that digital only deluxe edition, but it's also gonna have a behind the scenes DVD Blu-ray, a soundtrack CD, an art book, and a Chen Storm Stout mass pad. Now that is a uh, legendary Pandaren Brewmaster. So all kinds of cool stuff. And that's gonna run you $79.99. Now you can pre-order all of these right now. Okay, so go check it out, get it done. Mr. Pandaria on its way September 25th. See you next time.